Following the new presidential order on COVID-19 compliance, recently signed into law by President Muhammad Buhari, Monday, the FCT Ministerial Enforcement Tax Team swung into action. With the coming of the second wave, the Enforcement Tax Team had in the last one month focused on enlightenment and public sensitization. On three different operations carried out at strategic areas in the FCT, the tax team made arrest of over 120 persons. At the popular Wuse market, the team was greeted by an empty water bowl, no infrared thermometer check, and officials and staff of the market being the major offenders on the use of face masks. Look at traders putting on these staffs here. They all took off. Ask them here now. They don't wear masks now. Uh, sir. Staff now wear masks. How, how will you? How will you preach? And people are, are to abide. I don't abide. No. Many people took to their heels seeing the tax team. Just around the Wuse market that play host to motor parks, a lot of arrests was made among motor park drivers as one tried to attack the tax team. <laughs> Moving forward, the tax team inspected the popular Mog Plaza and UTC. Several arrests were made, even as vendors were seen making bricks sales. The tax team also made arrests in commercial vehicles just at the Eagle Square for not wearing face masks. Okay, please save them the stress. Now you come, let's go. The offenders were then paraded before a mobile court at the Eagle Square, presided over by Justice Idayat Akoni. Addressing press. The head, Publicity and Public Enlightenment, Iharo Atta, speaks on the exercise. The judge, in her wisdom, after seeing what transpired here today, uh, that's the judge, uh, Idayat Akoni, uh, she actually gave a very strong ruling that three key, uh, the, what do you call it, now, areas of default, as the Wuse market, the UTC market, and the Mock Plaza, be shut down until they comply. Ataz says the enforcement is not restricted only to the tax team, but all the security personnel. Our chairman, who is the commissioner of police for the FCT, Mr. Balachiroma, have ordered all DPOs, all area commanders, all the policemen under his formation to ensure that they enforce the usage of face masks and physical distancing that even include our transportation and other areas. So he throws more light on the sentence. The prison term should not exceed six months, based on the order the president signed. So the judge can give you one week, two weeks, three weeks, depending on the judge's discretion. As at the time of filing this report, more offenders were being brought to the mobile court by other security personnel. F.V. Aguari, ICV News, Abuja.